Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Sark Sun and this is Daily Rambles. Today we are doing Pokemon Season 1, Episode 16 of the Indigo League. And we're doing the episode Pokemon Shipwreck. So we start off with uh, Jenny does a burial at sea for Ash and Company and Team Rocket. And it was like a very actually emotional scene and I actually really enjoyed it. And then we cut to where Ash and Company are awake and they wake up to at the bottom of the sea and they're basically in between two trenches like in the middle. Um, it's, so in the middle it's like really raised up and and the ship is upside down and it's tilted and so if it can become displaced and fall to either side at any moment. Then, <clears throat> then we cut to where Team Rocket wakes up and I'm from daydreaming, daydreaming on a beach and they kept getting hotter and hotter and that's because they had the burners on them and that's why they woke up. And so Jessie did something very, very, very stupid. She got her Ekans out and used acid on the hull to try to get out and that just created water. And so um, we got to where Misty, Ash, and Brock strategized to try to get out. So Misty used Goldeen to look for a way out and finds Team Rocket and saves them, brings them back. So after they revive them, uh, they decide to battle. <laughs> And so when they release their Pokemon, the boat starts to tilt. And so they try to equalize the ship over and over again. It was actually a very funny scene, actually. And so they decide to return the Pokemon and they do a truce. So they're going to go through the hull because that's the weakest part of the ship. So Misty uh, made a model of the boat because she knew about the ship a lot. So she knew about the model and basically how to get through it. So Ash got an idea to get across the engine room because the engine room was on fire, <laughs> for one. So they used bubble, uh, bubble source vines to get across and they used Charmander to um, weld through the hull. So they managed to get out and so um, Team Rocket uses magic card and it's just super, super sad because um, everyone has had their um, water Pokemon to use. And then we cut to where the ship falls, but the gang made it a raft. Then Ash sends Pidgeotto to find land, but finds Team Rocket. <laughs> and the gang thought they were gone, but they were not. <laughs> and they got hungry, and they they kind of want to eat Magikarp. <laughs> and that's my dog, I'm sorry. <laughs> He's very attention-seeking. And he likes to be around me all the time. So anyway, um, but basically, um, thanks to Meowth, he said um, that it's just literally just skin, um, scales and bones. That's it. <laughs> and Jane kicks it and says, I don't want you anymore. And evolves into Gyarados, who is very, very, very upset. Very upset. <clears throat> and um, <laughs> basically, if someone's other... Gyarados to come and play with them. And so Missy uses her water Pokemon to run away, and like I said, it causes other ones and causes Dragon Rage and creates a water tornado where they get sucked into. And that's the end of the episode. Really good episode. Again, I'm going to, have to give this a plus. I really enjoyed this episode because we get to see that they're actually working together between Team Rocket and Ash and everyone. So that's actually pretty neat that they actually decide to do that. And the, just the dynamic between the, um, everyone because Team Rocket is always very skeptical of the Ash, Misty, and Brock because of all the history. Even though we're only 16 episodes in, the, uh, <laughs> still. They're not very, they don't trust others at all. And they're first one to break one, so. <laughs> but anyway, I, I really enjoyed the episode and that's one difference this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree. Just tell me your thoughts down below and don't forget to subscribe. It helps out the channel a lot. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye everybody.